screwdriver in my hip. Okay guys, this is the story time about how I got stabbed with a screwdriver. Let's get started. Okay, so this was probably three, four years ago when I was in my sophomore, it was my junior, sophomore, junior year of high school. And I met this girl that I went to school with. I'm not gonna name any names, but we were very platonic. So it was kind of like a friends with benefits type of thing. You know how it is. And you know, those uh, girlfriends or whatever, they're, they're friends that say like, if you hurt her, I'll kill you type of things. I'm not even kidding. Her friend took it to a whole nother level. So basically, um, where I live, there's a lot of high school football games. So I went to them a lot and I was at one um, on a Friday night and I was talking to a whole bunch of different girls because it was, I made it very clear with this other girl that it was very platonic. There was nothing else going on. That was, that was it. That was, that was what I told her. So anyways, she ends up seeing me at a football game um, when I'm talking to these other girls and then she comes over to me and starts like yelling at me getting getting in my face and it was just a crazy f situation because we're at a football game there's a whole bunch of people around I mean people are staring literally out of the stands and I'm thinking what what is going on right now why why are you yelling at me it's it's not that serious anyways I'm hashing it out and that same girl that I was talking to you about before that basically said if you hurt her I'll kill you so then her friend comes over to me and starts yelling at me screaming at me and and then her the original girl backs off and now it's just the, me and this girl yelling and then a whole bunch of other girls surround me and I'm just getting like they're just yelling screaming at me and I'm like what we're in high school. Why, why are we doing this right now? Like, this is, this is really stupid. And <clears throat> anyways, it goes on for probably 10, 15 minutes. And the girl that threatened me walks away. And so does everybody else. So I'm like, okay, maybe it's, we're done here and we don't got to worry about it anymore. So I walk away and then on my way out, probably about an hour later, I'm out, I'm leaving. <laughs> And I walk to like the the sidewalk off of in front of the school. And this girl, the girl that threatened me, walked up to me and started screaming at me again. And I'm like, why don't you just go home? Like, what is the point of this? Changing words, because at that point I'm pretty mad. Um, I don't want to be having this conversation. I I just want to be done with this conversation. So. I turn around and she literally pushes me. Okay, I, you know I'm not gonna I'm not gonna turn around, push her, hit her, nothing. I'm I'm bigger than her. I wasn't gonna do anything like that. But I turned around. And I'm like, hey, you need to stop. This girl, and I kid you not, pulls out a big flathead screwdriver <laughs> and starts like you know like people with like knives to like threaten you or like do that to you. That's, that's basically what she was doing to me. So my, my thought is to disarm her, be like, okay, this is, this is really stupid. Maybe try to take it out of her hand. <laughs> this girl lodges a flathead screwdriver right into my hip. And it goes in, it, it goes in, it went in and then she ran. And I'm sitting there with a flathead screwdriver in my hip. <laughs> my buddy took me to the hospital. Uh, they got it out, stitches and all that. And I, I press charges because that's assault. That is assault. And anyways, it was, it was a crazy situation that escalated for no reason. I mean, like I told you before, it was very platonic. There was there was nothing going on. There were there was nothing said about me and her being together. Nothing like that. Obviously, three to four years ago, it's it's not a big deal anymore. But at the time, and then after, I'm like, 
why did she stab me with a screwdriver? You know, if you're gonna stab someone, use a knife, I don't know, scissors even, I don't know. I mean, why a screwdriver? <laughs> Maybe the closest thing she could find, but just a stupid kind of funny situation that escalated for no reason at all. Um, and I, I don't know, it was, it was crazy night. That's it. That's basically the, the story. And anyways, um, I hope you guys did enjoy the video. Uh, short story again, sorry. Um, but I hope you guys did enjoy the video. Please like and subscribe. And if you guys want to see more stories, comment down below. And I can I can see if I can figure something out for more, more stories. And yeah. All right, guys. Peace.